Joining us now is Jeanette Ewan. Thanks for being with us today. Thanks for having me. No problem. So tell us more about what you do. I'm an interior stylist, so for years I have styled amazing spaces like the Dream Home. I work a lot on television, recently shot a show about two years ago with Ty Pennington and hope to be shooting a new one and also design a lot of great products for interiors. Great, so how did you get into this industry? I really started in magazines as an editor and a stylist, so I would style beautiful homes for magazines. Then I started working on television with uh, Debbie Travis and Ty Pennington and great shows like City Line, and then sort of moved into product development from there. Great, so what are some trends that are going on with interior design and home and reno? I love that more is more. We've seen minimal for so long and a yeah. lot of reclaim, which is cool, but now we're seeing sort of Liberace inspired interiors coming back, which is really exciting for me. Lots of crystal, lots of ornate patterns, bright colors. I think interiors are becoming fun again. So tell us about your current projects. Current project is I'm working on a wallpaper line down in my design studio in Los Angeles. Also working on a new show, which I can't talk too much about yet. Okay. And of course, traveling across Canada and the United States regularly, visiting all my favorite TV spots to bring everyone great decor and design trends. Great. And where can people find you on social media? Check me out at JeanetteEwen.com. So this segment is called In the Hot Seat. So what are some of your guilty pleasures? Oh my gosh, some. I have so many. Probably my biggest is travel. I'm a travel junkie and I love luxury hotels and flying first class, which is gonna put me in the whorehouse, but I'm addicted to it. Also, I love racing, so um, anytime I can get out on the rally car track, it's my favorite thing to do. And if you were stranded on a desert island, what would you bring? Lip balm for sure, a little sunscreen, and a big bottle of Vokuko. <laughs> What's something that you have beside your bedside table? I have beside my bedside, my sleep mask. I can't go anywhere without it, and of course, it's zebra print and very, very fun. And also, Dorothy Draper's Decorating is Fun, which is my guide to decorating and all things style. Great. So look into that camera and show us your best scary face. So if you were to put on your iPod right now, what would you be listening to? This is a little embarrassing, but Belinda Carlisle, I'm having a total 80s kind of girl rock group or solo star moment. If you were a superhero, what would your power be? Oh, it's so hard to choose. I'd either want time travel or to be invisible. I think to be invisible, yeah. I'd sneak around and spy on people a lot. <laughs> what do you think Hoss means? Hoss means to me great style, great renovation tips, and designing and rebuilding your home with confidence. Of course you're not a tool, but if you were one, what would it be? I think my business partner would call me a tool, but if I was one, I would probably be a scroll saw. Air guitar or air drums? Let's see. Oh, can I just dance around with my hairbrushes and my phone? Okay, air guitar. Probably drums. I don't know. Both of those are embarrassing. Can we cut that? I'm crushing on Haas because it's my all-time favorite home and renovation magazine.